have a haul video for you today. It's kind of Black Friday-ish because I, there's some stuff from pre-Black Friday and post-Black Friday. So I figured I'd just kind of lump it all together. I know it's kind of late for a Black Friday haul, but I was actually waiting for my Cyber Monday elf order to come in and kind of put it all together. But it's, it's taking way too long and it's actually shipping to my home address, as in my parents' house, not here. So... That'll be separate, and it's actually a big order in itself, so that should be sufficient, I think, for an elf haul. So, without further ado, uh, let's get started. So I'll start with the pre-Black Friday stuff. I'll go in like chronological order here. So I went to Forever 21 and picked up a few things that I am currently in love with that you guys have actually probably seen already. Some of it was featured in my uh, last minute Thanksgiving outfits ideas. Outfit ideas video. Okay. So the first thing is this jacket that I also wore in my um, 17 announcement video, but this is this, I guess, utility jacket, and it has the option of having these snapped up sleeves, or you can roll them all the way down, which I really like. The only thing about this that I kind of am annoyed with are these, like, strings at the bottom, so I did, like, tie this one up because they were, like, flying all over the place, and then when I get in my car and it would get, like, stuck in the door, I was like... <laughs> So annoying. But um, <laughs> other than that, I really do enjoy this. I was looking for just a basic utility jacket that I can throw over pretty much anything, and this fits the ticket. I do want to mention though that I did get an extra small in this because it is fairly oversized. Um, I will link it in the description box because I did see it on the website and I was reading reviews about how it is big. I did try on the small and I could have gone with that, but the extra small is already big on, uh, on its own, so I ended up going with that one. The next thing is this shirt that I did feature in my um, last minute Thanksgiving outfit ideas and it is a basic black t-shirt with a pocket on the front but then again these stripes on the back I love this I love just strange like unexpected features like this because it is so basic and then you got those stripes on the back so this is definitely more of an edgy piece depending on how you style it could be very basic if you um, you know just throw something on over it and the stripes just disappear. But I really do like this. I love things like this. So I think this was like around $15 or something. So it was really good. The last thing I got from Forever 21 is this jacket that I did feature in my last favorites video because it is the best thing ever. It is this motorcycle style jacket, if you didn't see that video, that I got for $15, which is insane because it is very nice quality. I can wear it with anything. I love wearing it because it just makes me feel like more of a badass. I don't really know if that's actually accurate, but it somehow does that. It has like all this nice silver detailing, I don't want to talk a whole lot about it because I already did. But I will link it in the description box if it's still available, which I hope it is because I know a couple of you guys have picked it up already and have said that you love it, so I think everyone should. This should be a thing. It should. Okay, so moving on to Black Friday stuff, we actually... <sighs> I hate Black Friday now because actually, you know what? When did anyone ever love Black Friday? To be honest, and why is it now like Black Thursday? Why why are people skipping Thanksgiving dinner to go shopping? It's driving me. Anyway, let's not talk about that anymore. So we actually went, you know, Black Friday shopping on Friday, and we went to the outlets for the whole day. That's what we always do because we always go up north for vacation, and then we go to the outlets out there. But we did end up going to the mall at the end of the day where everything was pretty much closed. So I did get to go to H&M though. It's the only place I actually got to buy something. But this deal is ridiculous. So I don't know why I'm so like diva today. Anyway. This shirt was originally $39.95. So it was $40. I would never pay $40 for this. I do like this embellishment up here above the pocket. But that's about the only thing that sets us apart from anything else. But... It was on sale for $14.95 as one of their holiday Black Friday deals. And then, if you guys use the app WRAPP, W-R-A-P-P, -P, if you don't, check it out because it's definitely worth it. You can send your friends, um, like, coupons and, like, dollar amounts to certain stores. Like, you can't just send them anything, but it's, like, for free. So you can send your friends, like, $12 to H&M. That's what my friend Jennifer sent me, and I used it, so I paid, like, $3 dollars for this. Three dollars. I know. It's crazy. So check out that app because it's totally worth it. I've used it a couple times before too, so rock on. Okay, so at the outlets I honestly didn't get, I, I only went to Cotton On and I got a nail polish and that's literally all that I bought on Black Friday besides that shirt. Um, 
I did pick out a couple things from Pac-7 that my dad's going to give me for Christmas, uh, but honestly it wasn't a really successful trip, but anyway, uh, I'm going to show you guys stuff that I got in Cotton On. The whole store was 50% off if I remember correctly, so I got this uh, open cardigan that has these cropped sleeves here, and it's just, I guess, it's kind of like black and white, like it's, it's mixed, it's I don't really know how to describe it exactly, but it's kind of like speckly looking, I don't know, but it's it's fairly long, it's nice, I don't know, I got a small, and it's originally about $25, and I again got it for half off, so not bad. And the only two other things I got there are two of their Infinity Scars, which are not part of the Black Friday stuff, but these are always $5 with any purchase, and I have... Now I have four of them. I have a green one, I have a red one, and then now I have these two. I highly suggest you guys check them out if you ever shop at Cotton On because these are my favorite scarves by far. So even though they're more wintry based, I still wear them like even during the spring and summer because that's normal. <laughs> but I love them. Like they're so warm and cozy and like just add something extra to your outfit. So again, I got the creamy one and the navy one. For five dollars each at Cotton On, I just, I love them. Okay, this is getting weird. And lastly, I have a few nail polishes. One of them I did get at the outlets, and the other ones I actually just picked up at Rite Aid last night. So, the first one is from Color Club. This is a brand that is popping up in some Rite Aids, but I haven't seen it in any other stores. And it's a very limited selection, but it is this crazy holographic purple. I will insert a couple pictures here because this polish is insane. The shade name is Eternal Beauty. They have a whole line of these holographic polishes, but... I've never owned a legitimate holographic polish. I've had glitters and I've had top coats, but never just straight up. This is insane. This is the coolest nail polish I have ever owned. I am obsessed with this thing. So I will, um, actually, I don't know if you, where, where was I going with that? I will look it up online and see if I can find like an Amazon link or something to it because a lot of people were asking how to get it. So uh, that is what I will do. <laughs> okay. And again, last night I went to write it and picked up a few nail polishes because <laughs> I had my last final last night and I was just like, I'm going to celebrate by buying nail polish. No, that wasn't what my thinking was. I actually went because I was like, I'm going to celebrate by getting Panda Express, which <laughs> sounds really lame now that I say it out loud, but in my mind it was like really exciting, so <laughs> that's what I did. And there's a ride in right next to Panda Express, so I went in. <laughs> okay, I need to stop telling the story. Okay, this is actually not that exciting either because I already own all three of these nail polishes. This is just like my second round at it because either they are, were used up or they got goopy and I couldn't use them anymore. So, two of them are from Sally Hansen. These are buy one get one half off. I got another strobe light, which is my favorite glitter to use for my galaxy nails. So, I've tried a couple other ones, but this one is just by far my favorite. I think the holographic glitters in here just really work. So, um, this is the one, if you were wondering what glitter to use for a Galaxy Nails, this would be the one. And, I don't think I really need to explain what this polish is. If you guys have been watching me for a while, you know this is my favorite nail polish ever. This is Pacific Blue. Everyone needs to own this. At least one bottle in their entire life. I'll probably own... I don't know. Why? Just... <laughs> okay. And the last polish, and the last item for this haul video, is Sinful Colors Nail Junkie. I bought this in high school, and I haven't really used um, that polish in a while because of the fact that it got really gunky. In fact, when I opened this bottle in the store, I was like, this is already kind of like a thicker formula, which is unfortunate. But it's the most beautiful glitter ever. I used to wear this over just any basic teal color, and it it's stunning. It's, it's so worth it. I think this was like $2, and it's really... Just a very, very pretty polish. Okay, so that is it for this haul video. I'm so happy to finally be filming. It, it was really weird to not film for an entire week because of finals. <laughs> so bad. Anyway, I have been um, blogging a little bit more lately since the whole 17 thing. I figured, well, if I'm going to be advertised as a college beauty blogger, Maybe I should blog a little bit more. <laughs> so I do have a couple new blog posts if you want to check them out. But that is all I have to say. Um, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye.
But wait, there's more! <laughs> I forgot! I got these at the outlets as well. Are these not the most adorable things you have ever freaking seen? I had to share them, so... Yay! Okay, bye! <laughs>